Hi, I'm Flo Fife. And I'm Anna Maivald, and we play for What For Women. We're going to be judging the finalists of the International Women's Day Poem Competition today. So we've got three poems here, and we're going to say the things that we like, um, and which one we think is the best. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so the first one, it's by Evie Mulholland of Rickmansworth Park, JMI. Are we all the same? Just with a different name. Does it matter your title or gender, or whether you are a forward or defender? We all have a dream, someone to be part of a special team, where we all dress the same, whatever our frame. Standing proud, in front of the crowd, we play our best to show the rest. In our matching tops, we want name calling to stop. We are different people, girls and boys, that biases, stereotypes and discrimination annoys. So yeah, I really like that one, I like the rhyming. Yeah, it's um, not bad. Strong start, isn't it? Really strong start, <laughs> yeah. It uh, blends together very well with obviously a lot of thought that's gone into it, so yeah, I like that Strong one. start, so. So we'll go into the second one now. It's called Let's Give It A Shot by Jessica. Wouldn't it be terrible, wouldn't it be sad, if only one gender in football was all we had? A world where everyone is valued, a world where everyone plays, the sport that can unify and bring us brighter days. Go grab your boots, go grab your kit, go get the ball and have a kick. Football is for all, no matter what. A team of love will lead to winning. Let's give it a shot. Another strong one. That's also Another good, strong one. <laughs> um, I'm a big fan of that, that line, a team of love will lead to winning. I think that's, um, I really agree with that. Really, really. Yeah. No, another really, really good one. And then the final one, so Rebecca Elson, um, who's a junior Hornet, and I don't know what this one is called, but uh, I open my eyes and all I can see is black and white, but when the girls walk on the pitch, I feel like a different person. Not just black and white, but all the colours of the rainbow. I can feel their love and joy surrounding me, and when I watch their faces when they win a match, it brightens up my day like nothing matters anymore. Now I can feel I can do anything. I'm invincible. I want to write about them in my own books that soon I will see in my local bookstore in the window. These girls make me believe I can achieve anything. These girls make me proud, not just today, but every day. And one day I want to be like them. I want my teammates to be every colour of the rainbow. Wow. Yeah. I think we might have saved the best for yeah, last, really. That, I think the thing that I like most about that one is that it really resonates with us. Mm. Um, that's quite, it's kind of why we play football, the line that says, um, I can't find it now. What was the line that I said I liked? Watch their faces. Like, yeah, yeah. Because we so, want to inspire girls, don't we? Like, I yeah. think that's why we play football, like we want to... But even with our own teammates, like when we win a match, seeing the whole team and everyone's reaction like it brightens up our day and that's one of the one of the reasons we play really and yeah I think it's nice that hopefully we can inspire young people like that um, by yeah playing so yeah I think that was probably I think we've got our clear yeah, winner really. All, all of them were, were brilliant but yeah, yeah I think the third sure. one definitely takes it so yeah well done to Rebecca. Well done to Rebecca Elson for winning the International Women's Day Poem Competition. Keep an eye out on the Watford FC Women's Socials for the winning video coming soon.